Charlie, what are you doing? <laughs> Luke, he's got crazy. Imagine he's talking with his imaginary friend. Tech issues. Yeah, like imaginary friend took part of my. <laughs> How's it going? Well, I'm good. Okay. What are y'all doing? You, why don't you bring your computer here when I'm it's working? Okay. Alright, I'm going to be honest. I had, there's one song I didn't master yet. DDG arguments. This is a lesson to all you future Centennial students. Yeah. Make sure you get your stuff done on time. And make sure you rehearse more than you do. Don't procrastinate. Don't be like me. Be better than me. Uh, Hello. <laughs> Can I see your scar? Yeah, sure. <laughs> oh, what'd you do? <laughs> There's the moment I got. Do you have food? Do I have food? What chocolate are you? I don't have chocolate. I have. You have chocolate and you're not Where sharing? <laughs> Chocolate. Don't go crazy out there. Like good? <laughs> no. Yeah. Less in my body because of workout. <laughs> Preferably, it is going to be on like the like the snare kind of hits when you guys stand up. And then this, this kind of scene's gonna change a little bit. It's gonna be more confrontational instead of like agonizing. So the tables are gonna be turned on Logan. After you guys stand up, Logan's also going to stand up, but it's gonna be much more um, mysterious and like almost as if he's like fearful. Uh, like his past is coming back to him kind of thing. Okay. How are you feeling? How are you feeling about mm -hmm. this whole Journey. World Star! Really? Yeah. Finally! Abracadabra. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, girl? I'm the one that cheated on you? Really? You didn't. You didn't. You should know what's going on here. Oh, yeah. You didn't. You didn't. You You didn't. You didn't. You You didn't. You well, this one can this stand. One. This is just power. You don't have to let me know. This is okay. just power. Okay. I like power. Look at my face. I'm tired of this. <laughs> so, okay. yeah, scene one is like... Tech, uh, if you could... Which the flashing? Okay, if you could do flashing. Flashing? Yes, okay. in this. Okay. Like, breathe. <laughs> Touchdown like Lito Shuck. She said, What a man like salt and pepper. She comes to with three girls like Hugh Hefner, a big stepper. Some like first down. Feel like what do you feel like it was good? Do you feel like you got stuff out of it? What do you think? Yes. Yes? Uh, it was good, but anyways, I think never time is enough. Never, never time, time is enough. Not well, the next yeah, you always find something to to improve, something to that For always sure. can be better. And uh, but it was really nice. For example, this time I noticed, uh, like as a director, I was like. Like last time, I know that some people I have uh, surrounded were like already actors or, right. you know, right? But this time, uh, 
they are in their process of getting or getting professional. So, I love it. so it was really interesting to see how I could I could handle their their potential cool. to the to the and not pushing them too hard. Like you have to do it. No, it's like we work with what we had and we work yeah, with to everybody's them. skills. That makes sense, and that was shown a lot, which I liked a lot. How everybody was using their own skills. It was really good because we had to work on a big scale project only two weeks and we really put the screws to it yeah. and we managed to pull off something amazing in yeah. all of our groups even yeah. when you know we have to come up with the idea from scratch so yeah. i think it was a really fun experience we learned a lot about each other's you know work ethic and stuff and great project i loved it yeah cool what was your favorite part about this whole quartet process my favorite part about the whole process, uh, oh, that's great, yeah. probably becoming comfortable with a song that I wasn't comfortable with at all. It took uh, it took a whole bunch of work, and I was still off key a little bit. But uh, no, it was really cool to just learn something that was kind of outside of my comfort zone and outside of my normal. My favorite part of this is the creation. It's like to pulling stuff together and having brainstorm and like finding the way between in like in, in all the collective, like all the collective finding a way to, to pull this project together. And all the creative process is my favorite part. I love it. It's like yes, that's it. What was your favorite part about like the quartet part? My favorite part was the second scene when uh, when the uh, which friend is it? Invisible friend and that his first date uh, came to him and offered her a drink and she tries to kill her and he tries to kill her. That was my favorite scene. So what was your favorite part about the whole quartet process? Um, my favorite part would definitely be just performing because the sounds bad. Not to like get it out of the way, but like the performance was fun. Singing and then the whole process about it. The process was stressful. So when you actually got to do it and go up and perform it, it was just like, and I'm done. <laughs> I hope I did good. <laughs> but yeah, that was definitely my favorite part.